Five seconds. Start. Sir, my first, first question is whether there is any particular strategy at all which our government is applying to control the price rise because we had the three years of the janta rule when there was no strategy at all even the plan was called the rolling plan that is why i am asking what is the strategy it is not my intention to theorize here or to sound scholastic because scholastic debates are not meant for parliament but common sense is i firmly believe that no theory can be viable unless it can be understood by common sense in a nutshell i look at the economic strategy of our government in the 1980s as radically different from the past there was hardly any difference in the styles and approaches of the previous two decades the approach then was one of the demand management without caring for the supply side the keynesian scholars who dominated the planning process in those days presumed that the role of the government in the economy was only confined to maintaining the suitable levels of aggregate demand and since the government alone could print money the chief instrument of demand it was also presumed that fiscal measures alone could control the entire economy thus demand held the key to all government policies and slowly the supply side got a back seat so when there was a glut of goods in the market it was thought that the crisis could be warded off by discouraging savings and encouraging spending that is through a fiscal remedy similarly in a condition of scarcity the first thing that the government would do was to tax the goods heavily thus trying to lower consumption by artificial means the proof of all this is there in the chain of licensing procedures the mage of statutes and laws binding business activities all formulated during the 1970s and the 1980s in one sentence the guiding principle then was demand creates supply i am happy that our government has revised this stand instead of being obsessed with the demand side for the first time we have launched ourselves on a program to tackle the supply side we now want to say that if the prices refuse to come down if the inflation rate leave frogs the government cannot solve the problem by taxing the goods by passing laws that will only discourage consumption the new strategy of our government is to remove constraints on supply on the artificial barriers between the producer and the consumer and give the manufacturing sector a chance to function without any hindrance the supply side economics has an emphasis on growth and not on distribution actually supply side economics is in drug direct contrast to the demand side economics which we have been following earlier though i am in full agreement with this theoretical shift which is now being 
टोटली रिवर्स्ड बाय द थ्यूरी दैट सप्लाई क्रिएट्स डिमांड आई वुड हैव बीन हैप्पियर इफ ऑल राउंड मेजर्स वर टेकन टू इम्प्रूव सप्लाईज वन वेरी इम्पॉर्टेंट पार्ट इन सप्लाई साइड मैनेजमेंट इज द इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर द टोनिंग अप ऑफ द इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर हैज टू बी डन विद ग्रेटर एफर्ट एंड विद मोर स्पीड देयर इज नो डाउट दैट द इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर हैज इम्प्रूव ड्यूरिंग दिस क्वार्टर पावर जनरेशन इंक्रीज बाय सेवनटीन परसेंट ओवर द कोरोस्पोंडिंग पीरियड लास्ट ईयर कोल प्रोडक्शन बाय अबाउट एट परसेंट एंड गुड्स मूवमेंट बाय रेलवेज बाय अबाउट सिक्सटीन परसेंट डाउन द लाइन देयर हैज ऑल्सो बीन अ राइज इन द प्रोडक्शन ऑफ सेलेबल स्टील बाय अबाउट ट्वेंटी सिक्स परसेंट सीमेंट बाय अबाउट नाइनटीन परसेंट क्रूड पेट्रोलियम बाय अबाउट सिक्सटी फोर परसेंट पेट्रोलियम प्रोडक्ट्स बाय ट्वेंटी वन परसेंट एंड फर्टिलाइजर बाय सिक्सटी फाइव परसेंट हाव एवर डिस्पाइट ऑल दीज इम्प्रूवमेंट्स आई स्टिल थिंक दैट आवर इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर इज वेरी मच इंफ्रा इवन दो आवर कोल प्रोडक्शन हैज रजिस्टर्ड सच अ शार्प इंक्रीज देयर हैज बीन क्रोनिक शोर्टेजिज फॉर सुपीरियर ग्रेड कोल यूज इन इंडस्ट्री द मूवमेंट ऑफ गुड्स ऑन द रेलवेज हैज इंक्रीज बट वन स्टिल हैज टू पोंडर हाउ मच ऑफ इट इज ड्यू टू हायर प्राइसिस फॉर ट्रकिंग एंड हाउ मच ऑफ इट इज जेनवन वी हैव ऑल्सो टू सी to what extent the increase in our power generation is because of the good monsoon because of which the generation of hydel power has to be commensurate with the supply side management which we are attempting in fact our attempts have to be doubled towards infrastructure within the next couple of months one crucial area of concern for all of us should be the money supply situation while i commend the efforts made by the government for decreasing the money supply situation in the country i still feel that the recent impounding of currency in our monetary systems is not adequate enough the cash reserve ratio and the statutory liquidity ratio have been increased this may curtail the liquidity of the banks to the trading sector stop